shall be thy nursing mother. The king shall be the nursing father. Three. And their queen thy nursing mother. And the queen shall be the nursing mother. Three. They shall bow down to thee with their face toward the earth. You shall bow down with your face toward the earth. It can't get any worse. Your judgment was established when the earth was given birth. So on the block with the ox, talk about it. We're prepared to give an answer. Talk about it. See, we know what we believe. Talk about it. Yelling priest said, Bring it out. Christian, right? Christian, right? Okay, so they, they taught you white Jesus. They taught you all of those things. Same stuff they taught us. The difference is, Jesus ain't white in the Bible. Right. That's right. That's right. This is indoctrination. So now we have to come out and we have to proclaim the truth as it is written. Uh, 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 no feelings involved. Cry aloud, spare not. Right? Go ahead. Romans 9 and 11. For Read the out. children be not yet born, uh -huh. meaning, neither having done any good or evil. It wasn't That's about right. what you all did. Nothing good or evil. Right? Go ahead. That the purpose of God according to election might stand. Read. Not of works. Not of your works. Read. But of him that calleth. But we were predestined right. to be his children. That's Let right. me get that Deuteronomy right. 7 and 6. Read. It was Amos said unto her, one. the elder shall serve the younger. The elder shall serve the younger. The so-called Caucasian man came out first, right? And then, go ahead. As it is written, Jacob have I loved. Jacob have I loved, because it was written in Malachi 1, right? Jacob have I loved, read. But Esau have I hated. Esau has he hated, read. Because it was just how he designed it, right? Y'all, the, the Caucasian race did a lot of hell on this earth. But, but he's not judging you based off, but he's not, not selecting you because of it. He's just going to deal with you how he sees fit to deal with you because of 400 plus years of holding the children of Israel in captivity here and not letting them go. We don't have a homeland. We speak English. My brother speaks Spanish because of your ancestors. All right. Go ahead. What shall we say then? Is there unrighteousness with God? So people are going to be like, that's not how God's supposed to be. God's not right for that. No. You don't know. What can we say then? Is there unrighteousness with God because of this? Read. Finish it. God forbid. God forbid. For he hath said to Moses, I will have mercy on whom I will have mercy. See, the most I say, he will have mercy on who he chooses. It's not up to us. Go ahead. And I will have compassion on whom I will have compassion. And he will have compassion on whom he has compassion. Read that. This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 7 and verse 6. Yeah. Yeah. This is what the Most High thinks Which about the disparage, the, the, uh, the, the, the children of Israel that are scattered within these countries and how they're living and how much he cares about them. Read. For thou art an holy people unto the Lord thy God. Uh-huh, we are a holy people, Quadash which means to be set apart, right. separate, sanctified. Right. Read. The Lord thy God have chosen thee to be a special people. See, unto we are chosen. That's right. And we are chosen to be a special people. Right. Go ahead. A special people unto himself. Above all people. Above all people where? That are upon the face of the earth. Right. Right. This brother is special above all people that are upon the face right. of this earth. Right. 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 See up here? With these fringes on and, and with these grizzly beards and everything like that, these brothers are the most special people that are on the planet. Right. 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 But when right. you look at how society treats us, they tell us we're nothing. Right. Of course. Now let me ask you, your name is Mike, correct? Big Mike. I'm from Big Mike from the wood. Listen, let me ask you something, Mike. How do you feel about that? How do you feel about what your people have done to the children of God? Not, not anybody else. The children of God. The same, this Bible is in every church. The, the ideology is in every church. The statues are in every country. The pictures are on every wall. When Dylan Storm Root went into that AME church in South Carolina and killed those black people, those black people, the pastor, let that man in that church. The only white person, let him in the church to sit and listen. Listen, all of the above, right? So how do you feel about that? I feel two things. Yes, sir. My ancestry did what the ancestry was way before I was. Of course, and I'm, and I'm not mad at that. But, but it's, you it's my responsibility to take myself and my family way beyond and say, absolutely.
Listen, listen. But guess what? Do you believe in justice? So we're going to see if you actually believe in justice. Because it's one thing to say, my ancestors did that back then. How do we rectify it now? Because nobody is stopping any of you from walking up and down Hollywood Boulevard. Nobody is, nobody is robbing you, shooting you, putting you in jail because of your color. You understand? You all are walking freely, and that's a beautiful thing. I ain't mad at it. I wish we could just have our land back. I wish we could just go home, but we can't. So we are suffered to stand here and, and call our people out of darkness and out of the, 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 the strongholds that your people have put them under. The delusions, the illusion of inclusion. I need you to understand something. Separation was the only thing we should have had. Right. But for some reason, you know how it is. If you tell a man that he can't have it, he gotta have it. Right. So if you tell us, oh, you can't eat with us, you can't eat in our diner, now all of a sudden, come on, man, we gotta fight to eat in a diner now. Right, I'm not mad at you. I want you all to have your land. Do what you gotta do, live how you wanna live. The Greeks, understand, the Greeks came up with monogamy. All these other nations, we had multiple wives like real men did. Right. Now women are, women are pigeon-holding men talking about, oh, I ain't gonna be with you if you get another woman because of the ideology that your people have taught them. Let me get that. Isaiah 14, let me get that. Amos, Amos 3 and 1. Amos chapter 3 and verse 1. Hear this word that the Lord has spoken against you, O children of Israel. See, the Lord has spoken against the children of Israel. See, he's spoken for us throughout the whole Bible. But in this instance, he's talking against us. We did wrong. We wronged our power, our God, our leader. Right? Go ahead. Against the whole family which I brought up from the land of Egypt, saying. Our first captivity was the land of Egypt. Right? under Pharaoh. Read. You only have I known of all the families of the earth. So he says, you only have I known of all the families of the earth. Right? But guess what? He's, he still blessed all the other nations. He gave the so-called Caucasian man the dew under heaven. You all can be on any land and nobody's tripping about that. Except don't go to the Amazon. Don't go to them people. Them people are shooting arrows and you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, they still got on the little little jockey stuff in, you know what I'm saying? The one thing I'm you know having a problem with yes, sir. is a feeling that you feel, at least communicated to me, that I'm not even able to have the light within me because I'm Caucasian. Because uh, how you feel? Uh, it's not about me feeling like that. Yeah. It's, it's, you will not have the light in you because it was never meant for you to have. That's right. That's why you, you've lived your life. You've did everything you've wanted to do. You might, See, you gotta understand, it's the indoctrination that makes you seek these things. But you've already been free. You've been living your best life. Where do you live? I work myself up from homelessness. Okay, but where do you live? I live in Bellflower. Bellflower? Yeah. Yeah, is that in the hood? It's right next to Compton, yes. Next to Compton, yeah, not in Compton. Nope, I go yeah. to Compton. Now. But when you Compton. look at Compton, you see the slums. I see myself and my family and mm -hmm. my friends going into Paramount, going into Compton, mm -hmm. and painting fences, helping on, people, help, helping build, helping people build their lives. Because it's he not helped out the he help out the niggas there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. he lived there. He don't live there. He live in Bellflower. See, so you gotta understand. We don't help out the white people. The reason we don't help out the white people is because the white people don't need help. The so-called Black, Hispanic, and Native American need help. That's right. About, you know anything about Killers of the Flower Moon? The Osage Tribe, it's the movie that came out the other day with Leonardo DiCaprio and Robert De Niro. I love this movie, man. It depicts how during 1920-ish, the Osage Tribe of Oklahoma was the wealthiest people per capita on the earth because they struck oil on their land. And you know what the white man did? He started marrying the women and killing off the tribe so that they can take the money. 
Yeah, watch the movie, Killers of the Flower Moon. Did you watch it? That's the reason they went to war with Iraq, bro. Hey, listen, listen. But they want oil, right? They want oil. Ladies, for me, I'm gonna go, but before I do, I, I, can I challenge you one thing? Before you go, yeah. I need to see if you're a just man. Yeah. We gotta read these scriptures. We gotta see, because I know you might be prideful. But we don't want you to be prideful because the God you believe in don't want you to be prideful. The God we believe in don't want you to be prideful. Let me get that in Isaiah. There's the book of Isaiah, chapter 49, verse 23. Yeah. Yeah. And kings shall be thy nursing fathers. And kings shall be our nursing fathers. Read. And their queens thy nursing mothers. And the queens shall be the nursing mothers. Read. They shall bow down to thee with their face toward the earth. So we're going to see if you're a just man. We're going to see if you even will do anything that the God of the Bible says. Are you? Let's see you get on your knees and bow. You want me to get down on my knees? That's what the Bible just you. said. Read. They gonna, shall bow. I'm telling you, I'm, this ain't my words. Read. They shall bow down to thee with their face toward the earth. That's what you should Would do. It make you guys feel better if I did that much. I'm not. I'm not here to feel good. No, seriously. No, no, I'm not. You know what will make me feel better? You empty out your bank account. Right. You want my cash out? Right. I'm. I'm, I'm not laughing. No, I'm not this is. This is serious business up here. I'm just telling you how I see it. I'm trying to let you off easy by just showing. Fucking bring it. Listen, we're doing this right now. Listen, don't worry. None of us do. Read. Read it again. I want you to understand. This book of Isaiah, chapter 49, verse 23. And kings shall be thy nursing fathers. Kings shall be the nursing fathers. Read. And their queens thy nursing mothers. And the queens shall be the nursing mothers. Read. They shall bow down to thee with their face toward the earth. You shall bow down with your face toward the earth. Come on, Big Mike. Come on, Big Mike. I got my glasses. Let me see you. Uh, you want me to hold it for you? Listen, man, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a helpful man. Hold on. Stay right there. Stay right there. We got to make this make sense. Read. It's the book of Isaiah, chapter 49, verse 23. Read And kings shall be thy nursing fathers. Read. And their queens thy nursing mothers. And the queens shall be the nursing mothers. Read. They shall bow down to thee. With their face toward the earth. See now, this is where it's gonna be a little tricky. Don't get up, don't get up, man. You gonna get up? You getting up? You know what? See? Because justice is just us. I don't see. Now see, now there we go again, right? What we've learned is they will never do what they're supposed to do. So the most high has to eradicate them off of the face of the earth for all of their wickedness. That's right! I'm telling you, you weren't done. He didn't finish the scripture. On the knees, and he's gonna finish it. Finish it. I'm trying to tell you. Isaiah, it's about pride. I'm trying to help you, big yeah. man. And king shall be thy nursing father. King shall be the nursing father. And the queen thy nursing mother. Queen's nursing, mother. the queen's nursing mothers. They shall bow down and the knee with, with their, their face toward the earth. earth. They shall bow down with their face toward the earth. And lick up the dust of thy feet. And lick up the dust of his foot. Listen, man. See, he don't understand what the Negroes and the Spanish have gone through in life. But he's going to stand here in front of the men of the Lord. He's going to stand here in front of God's chosen people. And read. It's the book of Proverbs, chapter 28, verse 5 in the NLT. Listen, man. We're not looking for respect. We're looking for justice. Right. Listen, we just read all you can do. We read what you can do. You're choosing not to. Get on the ground. You're not licking the ground. You're licking everybody's boot up here. That's right. You don't understand anything. Oh, I do understand. You don't get it. Remember, you picked up the book. They lied to you. They lied to us. The difference is we know the truth and you don't. So what we're doing in 2024 is we're teaching you, Big Mike. Don't be a little man out here. I, you're either I, on your knees, you're either on your knees. I'm not here to hear you plead with me. Listen, I'm not here to hear you plead with me. Your people have skinned the backs of my people, man. I don't care about how you feel about any of this. I'm telling you the truth. You will either bow down today or you'll bow down one day. That's right. Because you have to lick up the dust of the feet of the men out here. Right. Right. You wasn't done. The, the scripture wasn't finished. You got up. 
You chose that your pride superseded what God chose for you. Right. Right. That's not true. Yes, you did. You I got up. You, as much you know, you can't exactly invite me anywhere, man. Mike, 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 God. Mike, Mike, let me tell you. I'm, I, let me tell you something about me, man. I don't care. I am so know. much about this life. I don't care about what you're talking about. Right. I care about the truth. I care about justice. I ask you, is your God just? You said you don't know how he sees things. Guess what? I showed you how our God sees it. Oh, it's right. something that you would never imagine. You can't fathom that he would tell you, your lily white ass, to get on your knees and lick up the dust of these niggas and chicks out here. We're not playing with you. We are the children of God. That's right. That's right. Because your pride is overtaking you. Right. Read. Right. Proverbs 28 and 5 in the NLT. Yeah. Yeah. Evil people don't understand All justice. But those All who follow the Lord the evil understand people. completely. Not understand right. justice. But those who follow the Lord. Just the men you see up here follow the Lord. They, they understand right. completely. Right. On your knees and there's the boot. On your knees and there's the boot. On your knees and there's the boot. Let's go. Isaiah 60 and 12. Read, man. Bring it up. Go, Isaiah chapter 60 and verse 10. Bring it up. Sons you know of strangers what? shall build up thy walls. He has a microphone and will talk over me. You don't right. get an audience. See, you don't, don't get an audience. This, this is what it's about. You think, you think you I'm mad because you don't want to bow? I've seen white people bow. It doesn't change my, my life. Exactly. When I say my teeth gets whiter. Right. You understand me? I want you to understand something, man. You all owe and right. you all owe a lot. Right. Uh, your pride is the reason why you can't do anything else. You are, listen, you didn't, they didn't have, they, people wasn't getting uh, hand jobs and cargo pants since now. All right? Listen, read. And their king shall minister unto thee. And the king shall minister unto thee. For in my wrath I smote thee. In his wrath he smote us. But in my favor have I had mercy on thee. But in his favor he's having mercy on us. Read. Therefore thy gates shall be open continually. Our gates shall be open continually. They shall not be shut day nor night. Right. Nobody's going to shut our gates. Read. That man may bring unto thee the forces of the Gentiles. See, he's, we're going to bring unto us the forces of the Gentiles. All of you nations. Read. And that their kings may be brought. You're going to be brought. For the nation and kingdom that will not That's serve thee shall perish. Slow down. Slow down. I need them to hear this. Read it. For the nation and kingdom that will not serve thee. For the nation and the kingdom that will not serve the children of Israel shall perish. They shall perish. Yea, those nations shall be utterly wasted. Those nations shall be utterly wasted.